I'm coming in hot. Trio Giannis former lawyer and ally attorney Jude Sabio reveals ex-senators link to Bicoy videos and tell-all newspaper column titled, Abyss of No Return. While everybody is talking about the Senate hearing on RA 10592 or the GCTA law, attorney Jude Sabio, the lawyer who filed the ICC case against PRRD in The Hague, Netherlands, made a damning revelation in his newspaper column about Trio Giannis' role in the Bicoy videos. In the newspaper column titled, Abyss of No Return Sabio gave a detailed account of his meeting with ex-Senator Antonio Trio Giannis IV which he described as unusually turbulent. In the said meeting, Sabio warned the senator to distance himself from Bicoy because it was just a trap apart from the dire lack of funds even for the ongoing ICC case. In the same meeting, Sabio's wife, untractoristerly, butted in and told Triulianis not to push through his plan regarding Bicoy because it will be the cause of his downfall that he will not recover from. Sabio said he was taken aback and angry by his wife's behavior who spoke in a loud voice towards a senator while angrily pointing an accusing finger and crying at the same time while lambasting Trio Giannis. Sabio, who obviously knows his wife very well, believed that she wasn't personally angry at Trio Giannis but she was simply trying to convey a dire, ominous message like an oracle in antiquity portending of a terrible event to come. The Novotel meeting, according to Sabio culminated with Trio Giannis offering him to lawyer for Bicoy, which was first conveyed via a Viber message from Trio Giannis close and security, staff Junil Senga Alang. Sabio claimed he was caught by surprise by the Viber message he received on April 23, 2019 because he had absolutely no idea about the senator's involvement with Bicoy. Junil Sengalang represented to me that Bikoi had handlers to whom I would be recommended to be his lawyer. Sabio said his task was to file a complaint in the office of the ombudsman as soon as Bikoi went public. Based on Sabio's story, it appeared he was leaning on accepting the job offer from Trio Giannis. However, Sabio claimed fate intervened to spare him from the disaster that had befallen instead later on the flag and IBP lawyers. Two days later, Sabio recalled another Viber message from Trio Giannis chief security and aide Junil Sengalang asking about his license as lawyer if it was updated. Sabio said he diligently replied to Trio Giannis aide, explaining to him that lawyers need not renew said license every year unlike other professions. Despite his best efforts, Trio Giannis aid sounded like he did not believe Sabio's explanation. After some thought, Sabio recalled he was jolted by the absurdity. Him being recruited to be a lawyer and yet he was being asked if his license as a lawyer is updated. Feeling insulted, Sabio narrated that the text exchanges between him and Trio Giannis aid turned ugly. He confessed, it caused him emotional distress. Judging by the tone of Sabio's voice, the ugly text exchanges between him and Trio Giannis aid influenced his decision to turn down the offer from then-Senator Trio Giannis to act as Bicoy's lawyer. In case you want to read attorney Jude Sabio's full narration of the circumstances surrounding his decision to turn his back from ex-Senator Trio Giannis, you may follow the link in the description. As of this writing, ex-Senator Antonio Trillianes IV has not released a statement yet in relation to attorney Jude Savio's claim, allegation against him. Your comment? Thanks for watching. Please like, share, comment and subscribe.